Greetings to you, my friends. My name is Nathaniel Vincent. I was a nonconformist Puritan divine and minister of the gospel of Jesus Christ in the 17th century. I was known as a smart, brisk, and well-rounded minister, being, as some describe me, a considerable scholar. I am pleased to inform you that Puritan Publications is working to publish all of my works in updated language for your more modern times. One such work they have completed is called The Day of Grace. What kind of day is it for you? If you are a believer, above all other things, it is a most wonderful day in Christ Jesus. Yes, you may be afflicted, or you may see God's providential blessing, but every day is a day of grace through Christ and His everlasting covenant. And when did this day of grace begin with you? Well, I'll tell you. You came to Jesus Christ because of His sovereign grace on the day of grace that was set aside specifically for you. This, I believe, is an important evangelical treatise. It shows you how you came to Jesus. I expound on Luke 19, verses 41 and 42. And when he was come near, he beheld the city and wept over it, saying, If thou hadst known, even thou, at least in this thy day, the things which belong to thy peace, but now they are hid from thine eyes. I cover five main doctrines from this text that apply to believers and unbelievers respectively. Doctrine 1. Christ is full of compassion. Isn't the Lord Jesus just full of compassion for us? He is the most compassionate Saviour and God. Doctrine 2. The Lord grants a day of grace. It is a wonder to me that God would even grant a day of grace. When man fell and lapsed into sin and misery, God was not obliged to save him, but he did. Doctrine 3. There is peace from God given in the day of grace through Christ. Where else would grace be given but in the blessed covenant of Jesus Christ? Doctrine 4. There is spiritual blindness in those without peace. Sadly, people that are lost remain in darkness, and what shall become of them if they do not see this day of grace appear for them? This leads me to the last doctrine. Doctrine 5. The plight of souls that are left in darkness. I explain what happens to those who are left in a state of misery and sin, those who walk in utter darkness which turns to be a call for conversion and salvation. This work is available right now at Puritan Publications. They have made this volume obtainable in both ebook and printed editions. You can get your copy through their website. But I would even tell you, don't settle with one copy, buy a dozen of these and hand them out to friends and family who still need a day of grace. This treatise is especially practical for those who need the grace of Christ for conversion. This is one of those works Christians should give their unbelieving friends and family members that God may use it to save them in his day of grace. May you be blessed in your evangelistic endeavors and may the grace of Christ shine readily upon you. Amen.